Yo, 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 what's going on everybody? CPA Strength here. We are going to do a little practice testing here. So welcome everybody. I already wrote out the D, D, C, Aid, Lur. I already wrote it out. Debit, credit, asset, draw expense, liability, equity, revenue. If they're going up. For going up in value, you debit it for asset draw expense. If it's a credit and going up in value, that would be for liability, equity, revenue. So let's just get into the questions and yeah, let's have some fun. So number one question is credits. Credits are right here. Uh... Sorry about that. Credits are right there. Now, do credits do credits decrease decrease both assets and liabilities? Let's see what um, decrease both assets and liabilities. Now, an asset if an asset's decreasing, you would credit it because if it's going if it's increasing, you debit it. So if it's decreasing. You credit it. So yes, that's correct here. This is correct. Now, uh, does a credit decrease with liability? That would be a no. Because um, if a liability is if a liability is going up, you credit it, not decrease. So we're going to say that's a no. Now we'll go to B. Does a credit decrease asset? Yes. Oh, who's in Texas? Uh, that's my uncle, my uncle Tommy Joe. What's up, big heck? <laughs> that's funny. Oh, no, we got the answer. Yeah. So, um, does it, does it decrease asset and increase liability? Does it decrease an asset? Yes. Does it increase, does a credit increase liability? Yes. So that looks, that looks good. That looks good there, B. Um, so... Do we need to go through the rest of the answers? No, we found the rest, but does it increase does it increase both both asset and liabilities? No, we know a credit decreases assets. Um so that doesn't look good. Does it increase assets and decrease liabilities? Thank, what's up, Shine Dog? Thank you, sir. Does it increase assets and uh, what's up, my neighbor? Does it increase asset and decrease liability? A credit decreases assets, increases liability. No. So our answer is B. Let's see if that's correct. Answer B. Bing, 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 bing. All right, let's go to the second one. I'm a little rusty. Shake some of the rust off. Shake some of the rust off. Let's go to the second one here. Do you still go to prison inmate channels? Uh, not so much. I do like Jay Williams, though. That's probably my favorite one. I don't... I feel like I've listened to most of them all. All of them, I guess. But I do like Jay Williams. Do you look, like some Jay Williams? All right, 46. Let's see. A debit to an asset account in indicates a debit. Here's our asset. A debit to our asset account indicates that, what, it's going to go up in value? An error? No. That can happen all the time. Eh, f screw that one. Um, a, a debit to an asset means a credit was made to a liability account. Oh, you gotta check out Jay Williams, bro, for reals. Um, a credit was made to a liability account. Yeah, that's 
true, but that doesn't mean uh, debit to an asset account. So I'm going to say, and eh, I don't like that one at all. All right, let's see. A decrease, a debit to an asset. So here we are, debit to an asset. A decrease in the asset. No, it's an increase in the asset. So I'm showing you. Oh, hey, what's up, Simply? <laughs> Did you get that answer right? Um, so I'm showing you how, you know, the DC Adler. DC Adler. Showing you how DC Adler will help you out in pretty much all the questions. I mean, just so many different questions. So I would write this out every single morning when you're studying let's see was it was it d answer was d yes it was all right let's go to the next one hey what's up camille uh, i cannot pronounce your name what up dude all right yeah, this uh this video got did really good on like I was looking through my previous videos and I did a count um I did one of these like four years ago and it did good so um I'm gonna try to do these again. What's up, honey? How you doing today? All right, the normal Asmed. What's up, Ahmed? What up, buddy? The normal balance of any account is the, okay, normal balance. Uh, I, I haven't done any cost accounting videos, I don't believe. Well, a few, but not really. I really, I really do this, fi uh, I guess, uh, financial accounting because I use it in my uh, daily, daily work. Because I have a business as, I guess, a tax preparer, bookkeeper, payroll. So I kind of, I use this like every day. I've been doing this for, what, 10, 15 years. And I just put a line through this now. Like I don't really, I, I, I've, I've written out DC Adler and debit credit, asset draw expense, liability, equity, revenue. So many times that I don't have to. I don't have to write it down anymore. But uh, I, I have a couple couple cost accounting uh, videos on my channel. But I don't do it as much as this. So normal side of any account is the side where it increases. I just know that. So it's the left side or the right side. Well, no. The side which increases that account, yes. Side which decreases that account. No, the normal side is increased, not decrease. So it could be the left or the right side. So I'm going to say it is C. Yes, the answer is C. Okay, let's go on to another one here. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Mr. 1845. I really appreciate that. I, uh, I try. I think this, these are really cool because, uh, you got that one right? Yeah, nice. <laughs> Sweet. Yeah, you can, oh, no, hope you didn't see that. Yeah, because you can go along. We can do this together, have fun. You can see how I would work it, how you would work it, da-da-da-da-da. All right, the double entry system requires that each transaction must be recorded I always start with A down. So in at least two different accounts, yeah. See, so it always debits, always equal credits. That's how I have a little equals there. Debits, always equal credits. You always need a debit, whatever a debit might be, and you need a credit, whatever that might be. So I do really like, I like that one. I think it's going to be that one, but let's see what all the other questions are. In two set of books, no, nah, I think you just need one set of books. I, um, so I don't like that one in a journal and a ledger. I don't think you have to do all that. I don't really know of all the journals and ledgers. I don't think so though. 
First as a revenue, then as expense. That one's just kind of stupid. So I say in at least two different accounts. A. Yo, we got it right. We got it right. Hopefully everyone got that right. All righty. Let's go. I think we got, let's see. We got two left here. We're going to do two more here. All right. A credit is not the normal balance for which account listed below. A credit is not the normal balance. Now, we just said before, no, a normal balance goes up in value. So, I mean, boom, we've got, we've got our, uh, we've got our a DC Adler right here. We're, we're like, we're like rocking and rolling here, right? Does anybody think, uh, what's not? Any answers from anybody in the class? Any thoughts on this? What is not a normal balance for a credit? So what, what does not go up in a credit? All right. Does the capital count, which is equity. Uh, no, simply, I, thanks for playing along, but I believe a revenue, see, is not the normal balance. Credit is not the normal balance. Thanks for playing along. But um, revenue is a normal balance. Okay, day. I believe. Let's just go to that one. Yeah, I believe it is. I believe it is D because drawing is a normal debit balance. D. We got a couple Ds. I believe it is. Yes, the draw. Because the li li uh, capital account, which is also known as equity, capital equity, is a normal credit, going up on credit. Uh, revenue, going up in credit. Liability, going up in credit. Or yeah. And so a draw or a dividend or distribution, it reduces equity. But it's a normal balance debit. So that would be the answer, I believe. Let's see. D, it is D. Good job, everybody. We've got one more for today. What up, Rhea? One more for today here. Let's see how we're going to do it. This one looks a little, um, a little more involved, but we can do it, I'm sure. Which of the following could represent the expanded basic accounting equation? Now, we haven't gone over the basic accounting equation. But it is in the DC Adler, though. It is assets equal liability plus equity. That's the basic accounting equation. And that's also the... Um, ugh, excuse me. That's also the balance sheet, but which of the following could represent the expanded basic accounting equation? Well, let's go assets equal liabilities, assets equal liabilities plus owner's capital or owner's equity plus owner's drawings no, the drawings would over be over here, so it would be a minus the drawings. So assets do not equal plus the drawings. We have a B answer. We have a B. Let's look at B here. Assets. Plus owner's drawings. Assets. Plus owner's drawings, assets equal. Mm, let's see, assets, yes, assets plus owner's drawings, because that would be the, our, our uh, debits over here. Let's see, assets, assets plus owner's drawings, plus expenses equal liabilities 
plus owner's capital equity, plus revenue. I do like that one. Uh, that seems to be good because that's, that's really aid equals lure, owner's capital for equity. I do like B. Let's see about whatever assets. Assets minus liabilities minus owner's drawings. See, I don't like that one because assets should be the same side as the debit. That should be the same side as the owner's drawing. So I don't really like that one. I'm not loving that. I'm not liking that. But this one actually threw me off for a second. Got a little heart palpitation. <laughs> I'll look look dumb in front of everybody but that's okay not the first time it won't be the last um assets equal assets equal revenues plus expenses no it'd be minus expenses so i don't like i don't like this one either is it b it is b all right uh Thank you, everyone, for watching, participating. Yeah, it's okay. We're all learning here, right? I know. And uh, it's always good for me to, like, refresh. Are you only, you're only 30 minutes away? Where are you, where are you at? Well, anyways, uh, I'm going to try to do a lot more of these. Oh, Margate, you're in the gate? Nice. I, I, I used to get my hair cut in the gate a lot. Nice. Um, <clears throat> yeah, it's about 20, 30 minutes from me. But anyways, now that I have the most people in the room, but uh, I'm gonna, I really love doing these. I'm gonna plan on doing these more often. These have a lot of good replay value, a lot of, uh, I think a lot of, what am I looking for? Substance. Um, I think if you're learning accounting and you can go along with me and we'll do it together, it's fun. Anyways, uh, I have a bunch of sheets out here. I like doing these. These are fun for me and I think everyone can learn. So thank you for everybody for commenting and uh, playing along and making it fun for me. I hope everyone have a blessed day. All right, thank you very much. Take care, everybody.